but you don't really win it. You have to pay for it. This is actually, you will be wined and dined in Tulum, very special. You'll be treated like royalty. And honestly, you deserve to go. And so does your guest. So I want to see you there. We have until October the 8th to qualify for anyone new that's just um, that's just wanting clarification. It's 10 enrollments. The enrollments must be 100 BV or more to count. 10 new enrollments or 10 new customers. Four consultants. Is that right? Four consultants? Yeah. Four people who share with two and one person you help advance to manager or above. Managers just, they have two people who've shared with two. It is so possible for anyone. This is such a doable incentive trip. And so with that, I'm fired up for you. And honestly, what I said to people is, hey, if you're trying to get back to executive, you're trying to get to executive, you're trying to get in these pools, winning Tulum is a great measurable goal because you get there along the way. And I'm excited for a lot of you. Lauren, with that, do you want to talk a little bit about your vision for the night and how we can possibly help people? Okay. So here's, because Jess is like beyond modest and humble. So I'm going to call a spade a spade. We all know that nobody has verbiage like Jess, right? I mean, I mean, what's she just saying? And I feel like maybe shot away. Like, no, like, like that's funny. Like these things just like roll off her tongue, but she's incredibly poised, has insane language, and she's very, very good at reaching other networkers. So years ago, Jimmy Smith, you know, shared with her, you know, how'd you do it? And he said, I went after networkers. And of course, there are people who came into this business with zero experience, me being one of them, right? And there's a lot of top earners in the company that have done it. But when you think about going fast and Jess is talking about like totally 10 x her business, you know, growing by a hundred percent, you know, keep putting it out there. Well, you can either go the slow track and find a lot of customers and then teach them how to post on social media, give some confidence to reach out to some people and like snail speed, you'll grow at like 1%, right? Or when you've got the velocity of Ms. Rigner and you're like, get the out of my way. Like if you go after networkers and people that have influence and reach and, you know, they're bringing in six enrollments in a week, like <laughs> Holly Gersh, eight enrollments in a week, like Katie Martin, the conversation is a little bit different. But the way that she casts the vision, the way that she shows the comp plan, the way that it really solidified what we all know here, that we have like the Willy Wonka comp plan, it was, it's just brilliant. And so I feel like I've been so fortunate to be a fly on the wall, either as a three-way call, you know, that we've done together and heard her kind of do her magic or I'm asking, I'm learning. And recently she shared a call and it's so good, but like with secrecy, I told her I wasn't going to send it to anybody, even though I wanted like 9,000 people to watch it. But I'm like, well, we're, we're sending this out with like this guy's private information, you know, where he lives, you know, where he works. I'm like, I don't think we should do that. And it would be like not even as closely effective if we edited it and tried to skim it. But I said, let's do it. Like, talk to me. Like, I'm coming over from a skincare company or like, you know, that you found me online and I was with a jewelry company or people that have sat out. I mean, I was on the phone today with an amazing business coach who was the number one income earner in a jewelry company that closed, not the number one income earner, the number one income earner in her region in a jewelry company in 2014. And she's like disenchanted and never thought she would come into the industry again. But she's curious because of things I've learned from Jess, from this posture, from being able to really not only talk about the products, not only talk about our culture, but to really see the comp plan. And so I'd ask Jess, I said, do it. Like, let's go through and let me ask some questions and, you know, see what she does and how she casts the vision. And we'll skim this reporting. We'll have the original for like the entire two call or if there's questions afterwards, but we'll skim a second one. Not that it's meant to go to your prospects, but that we can use it for a future training call. So that when you have builders come on, to like watch how Jessica Rigner teaches the comp plan, listen to how she casts the vision and to grab those sound bites. And I will just say, anybody can do this. Like right now we're in awe of her language. I've known Jess since the very beginning. And I remember her being like, what's an adaptogen? What, why do I say this word? Like, tell me what this is. I don't know. And she was an oh, absolute master that. student of yeah, listening to Susan Sly, listening to Lynn Hagedorn and be like, say it again, I got to learn it. And suddenly she would like reiterate these things. I'd be like, where, where'd you get that? She was like, I don't know. Tana Kirkpatrick said it once. It's good. Right. I like it. Or she was just incredible that if we all have something like that, that's what I was hoping to do tonight. Most of my content for, for the record is probably not original, but I've been saying, I've been, I'm, I'm a great imitator of people. I'm a great listener of people and I know what works. So Lauren, if you don't mind, I'm going to start by echoing some of the things you say and kind of where my 
vision for what, who I'm looking for comes from. And I want to tell you, if you're committed to accelerated growth, there are a few things that I'd recommend and you just describe them. So the first thing is the top of my funnel looks a lot different than a lot of people. So I'm looking specifically seeking out people who are great connectors, who have a skill set, who have a profile. And I'm going to tell you, if you've heard me say this a million times, I just want to ask you one question. Are you doing it? And if it's the first time you're hearing me say this, I am encouraging you to do it. When I do it, which is every day, and I'm telling you, here's today. If you think I'm kidding, this is today. I write down, today, I allow myself to attract people who are. You may have heard me say it 75 times, because I tr every time I train about this, I say the same thing. Are you doing it? And are you attracting the kind of people you want? Because if you're not, if you're not doing it, I'm going to encourage you to do it. If you are doing it and you're still not feeling like you're getting the right people, I want to encourage you to go back and look at what you're writing down. Today, I allow myself to attract people who are influential, motivated, coachable, charismatic, magnetic, experienced in this industry, hungry for more in their life, unstoppable, ready and in the right season of life to do this kind, committed, and great connectors. And I write that down and I see it. There is power in the feeling. And I promise you, it is every day. And I, you can see, I wish I could show you guys, but I've shown you what I do every single day to get in an energy state to connect with the right people. The top of my funnel looks different. I also am a top-down approach person. But what Lauren was describing is Guys, this is nine years in the making just in Isogenics. Before this, I was a trained vice president of sales, a trained salesperson. I have been reading about sales and perfecting that craft for a very long time. I love to read about NLP, Neuro Linguistic Programming. It's about language. Here's what I know. Brandy Brokaw is masterful. You know what Brandy Brokaw tells me all the time? She sends me pictures all the time of her watching recordings of me. When I would do calls with Brandy Brokaw, she would literally record them and then she would watch them. And there's some, an expression that I say, I don't know where I ever started saying, but I would say, guys, this product is bananas. It's bananas. Well, Brandy Brokaw started talking about bananas. And then we recently brought on this girl, Jessica Holland, who is a networker in her hardcore. And Jessica Holland said something. She said, I heard her talking to me. She goes, that is, this product is bananas. Okay. Brandy Brokaw and Jessica Holland are masters at this. They're also unbelievable imitators. When they hear something that works, it's not the word bananas, it's the energy around it. But they both conjured the same energy using the word bananas. So top of my funnel, Here, here's, my, here's my vision for this. So you guys know I have a background in the industry of network marketing. What I know historically about the industry of network marketing is when you see the economy constricting in the way that it is right now, people are feeling tight at the grocery store and the gas pump. They are feeling pinched. When you see that historically, when the economy starts constricting, you would see our industry booming because people are looking for ways to create more income without spending more time outside the house. Okay, well, here you find us in 2022, and there's a few things happening that are very noteworthy and really important for the growth of our industry, and specifically this team. There's a lot of opportunities for people out there outside of network marketing. I could go Uber. I could do Uber Eats. I could do an Etsy store. I could, you know, my son was on an app tonight. He said, Mom, if I take pictures of receipts, this app will pay me money. There are a lot of competition of what people could do to earn money. So that's the first thing. But the bigger the bigger variable that I see is that our industry right now is quiet. Not just quiet, freaking silent. Let's be honest. Look at your newsfeed. Years ago, you used to look and there would be companies out there being loud. You'd see post after post of people proudly representing network marketing, inviting people to join them, hosting events, having events at hotels, doing Super Saturdays. And this isn't just an isogenics. This is the industry. Have you guys noticed? Drop a one for me if you guys agree. It's gotten a little bit quiet in our industry. Here's what I want to tell you. This is what this means. There is no shortage of people looking for extra income, but there is a very silent 
population out here who's not talking about what we have. And if they're talking about product, a lot of people aren't talking about opportunity at a time when it's never been more critical for people and they're ready. Here's the other thing that I've noticed is that there are a lot of people who are aligned to the wrong company, a bad comp plan, made changes, corporate irresponsibility, and they've sidelined themselves out of this network marketing industry. But make no mistake, they are exceptional networkers. And they've signed, look at Brandy Brokaw. Brandy Brokaw left this industry seven years ago. She was a seven-figure annual earner. So when you look at Brandy's, Brandy's success, I want you to understand she was a seven-figure earner in network marketing, and she swore off the industry. She said, never again, never again, walked away. Well, I'm so grateful, Daniela Barrett, that you were bold enough to say, I'd love to just introduce you to, because Brandy, I'd love you just, incredible women should know each other. I want to make this connection. So I want to honor Daniela Barrett because there are thousands and thousands of people who've been impacted because Daniela's boldness. And guys, I got on the phone with Brandy. We're going to talk tonight about kind of how that conversation, I wish Brandy, Brandy's now hosting. By the way, this is a beautiful thing. This is duplication. Brandy's team is now hosting these huge now onboarding prospecting nights on the same time as our team call. And you know what I say to that? Freaking awesome. Duplicate, go. When you bring in amazing people, may they duplicate and grow. I wish Brandy was on the call so we could sort of reenact that whole conversation. But what I want you to know is that we'll talk about what we did, but my point to you is that there are people out there. My gosh, I see I see people on this call right now. I mean, goodness gracious, Jessica Rose, this exceptional networker. And she knew she wasn't aligned in the right company. And she, we had another conversation and I just thought, oh my gosh, this girl is magic. She's not in the right company. They're making changes. They're doing things that aren't serving the field. And people are looking, go, oh, the writing is on the wall here. This isn't for me. So I believe that there are a lot of people out there looking. I also, I don't know if, I think I sent this to you today, Lauren, that when people... I look for people who are natural connectors and maybe they're salespeople in their life. And listen, lots of people, please understand this, lots of jobs, most jobs are sales jobs. People don't even know it. Teachers are selling students every day, show up and behave. Show up and be interested in this learning concept. You're in sales, teachers, I love you, you're in sales. By the way, people are in sales who are, who are, are selling to an internal client. So I'm in marketing. I'm selling people on this, why this is a great idea. I'm in sales. Realtors, salespeople. You're in beauty industry? Michelle Stan, esthetician. Heather Champion, Jessica Stanley. You, my friends, are incredible salespeople. You know who the best salespeople are? Dental hygienists. They're in sales. They're great. What I mean by sales is you're a great connector. You're convincing to people. You have an, a way that people trust you. I look for people like that. Well, today, a woman, an amazingly beautiful energy woman wrote me on Instagram. She wanted to connect because she's representing a company who is, it's merchant processing. Basically, she would help you. If, you, if I had a store where I sold bracelets that I made, she would help me get me a credit card processing for my website. That's her business. She wrote me on Instagram and she was like, hey, for your business, do you take, do you accept payments? Thankfully, you guys, are we lucky or what? We don't have, for, and I have multiple streams of income for Amazon, Walmart, real estate. I don't have to accept payments through a credit card on a website for anything. So I said, listen, no, but I'm going to prospect her back. We're doing a Zoom call on third, tomorrow. We're doing a Zoom call tomorrow at one o'clock. I said, listen, you have an amazing energy. I feel like I should pull this up to tell you exactly what I said to her. But I said, listen, I love your energy. I would love to connect with you because I think you'd be amazing at what I do. Unfortunately, I don't accept credit card payments for any of my businesses, but A, I'd love to connect and learn more about you. Maybe I can direct you and introduce you to some people. I was talking to my husband about this and I want you to write this down if you want to know, like if, if I, I could train you all to be amazing salespeople. Isogenics though, guys, is not a sales transaction. That's the greatest thing for you. I want people with skills of being compelling, being a great connector, being influential. But sales, traditional corporate sales is transactional. Lauren has a problem. I have a solution. We handshake, we enter into a contract. It's transactional. No one's life has changed. Maybe, you know, maybe your company saved a little bit of money on the bottom line. That's transactional. 
thankfully, what we do uses those same connection influence skills, but it's relational. It's do you like me? Do you trust me? And so what I know about sales, and I told my husband this, because if you know, if some of you know, my husband just retired as a high school principal and he started a business that he's now feeling like he's in real sales. And so I said, Doug, one of the things that I've learned in sales is whoever adds value first wins. You want to be in the pole position. You want to add value. Whoever adds the most value first wins the day. And guys, I don't look, I am looking constantly for ways to add value. I did a call with a woman. We'll talk about how that went, but I did a call with a woman. She's a top earner in another company. She's a friend. She's become a friend because I gather a lot of friends that I admire in this industry, but we started talking about, and I told her about this book that I love. It's written by somebody, you know, Gina DeVay. She's become a good friend to me. And Gina DeVay wrote a book that changed my life called Audacity to be Queen. And this girl, her name's Katie. Katie was saying, hey, this book sounds so good. I'm like, don't buy it. Send me your address. Well, I, Trudy, I had the book sent. Trudy puts it in beautiful gift writing. I write a handwritten note, send off the book. Whoever adds value first wins, but what do they win? You know what? I feel amazing about it. I feel like the world rewards that kind of generosity. Lauren, you are one of the best people. You add value. You can't even help it. You add value by accident because you're so conditioned to see where can I add value? Erica Rothenberger, constantly adding value. If you meet Erica Rothenberger, she has zero agenda, but if you meet her and you express any interest in any field where Erica has a modicum of connection or influence, she will be she will be introducing you to that person. I've watched her do it to my niece. I've watched her do it to so many people. She'll make that connection. Whoever adds value first wins. You don't just necessarily win someone in isogenics. You win the day. You're the winner. You're the MVP, the real MVP. So Lauren, I know we talked about role-playing. So I'm talking all top of the funnel. Fill your funnel with people who might be looking. Go back through. This is a couple of things I want you to do. You're writing down your attraction statements and I want you to go back through. Maybe it's your Facebook friends list. Maybe it's your phone contact list. Start at A, friends. Go all the way through. And I want you to look at people who maybe they've been in the industry years ago. You used to see them posting about a skincare company. You used to see them posting about something else. Maybe they've been a networker. Maybe they've done something that is networking-like. They had a nonprofit. They planned events. They invited you to things. They always are hosting pajama parties for their friends in network marketing, or they're, they're those kinds of connectors. They have a natural, those people show themselves. And I promise you go back and be like, oh my gosh, wait, she did network marketing years ago. And the approach, what I'm saying to people what I mean by it, for anyone who's new, a top-down approach means that, let me tell you, the, when Lauren was describing, she, you, were, you were nice and you didn't say what an awful freaking mess I was in the beginning. Because I used to talk to you always about product first. Guys, I love you. Say, let me save you from being who I was nine years ago. Product first is not the right answer. I was so excited about the product that I would not just tell you about the product first. I would message back and forth with you ad nauseum, write you literally research papers, length messages, include the price, everything I would urge you never to do now. But more than anything, when I switched to saying our best freaking product is this opportunity because you get all the other things. So I lead now, if Kim Kardashian walked down my street right now, I'd run out there and I'd be like, Kim, I know you're interested in multiple streams of income. I have got something for you. You got to take a look at this. And this is what I would say to her. Kim, I have, we have market disruptive products here, products the world is clamoring for and they can't get results like these anywhere else. We've developed a three-step simple system for anyone can share it. And there is a compensation plan here that will blow your mind. Absolutely blow your mind. I mean, Kim, you sell good American jeans. You got you Kardashian good American jeans. You but you earn once. But imagine if you earn good American jeans, if you earn money on every time I told someone about my good American jeans and they bought them. Imagine this long tail of income that you'd accumulate of compounding funds based on this whole thing of me doing that. And it's amazing. If I sold them to someone, you'd still get more money. And when we, we pass it down, the sister of the traveling pants, imagine you'd get more and more money. And so I would just literally tell her, I would tell anyone, I don't care. People say, oh, that person's really successful. Secret, you would have looked at me before Isogenics and thought I was too successful. And you would have been extremely wrong, extremely wrong. Because 
I believe if Bill Gates was walking down the street and saw a five spot on the ground, do you think he's not going to bend down and pick it up? You can guarantee it. Every person I know, you know, Lauren and I are mentored by Jenny Elo. Look up her husband. He was in the NBA for 14 seasons, multi, multi million dollar earner in the NBA. You think Jenny Elo didn't run for the moon, become a million dollar, the number 96 millionaire in isogenics and say, I won't rest until I help so many other women become seven figure earners in isogenics. And boy, has she done so. So I want to just tell you the top down approach. And so I'm going to tell you, Lauren, Lauren, if I'm reaching out to you, I'm going to say, Lauren, You have an amazing personality. I want to catch up with you more later, but I got to tell you, girlfriend, you would kill it at what I'm doing right now. You would absolutely kill it. So a lot of people that say, and I've read people say, hey, I'm going to, I want to reach out to people and they say, hey, are you using a great collagen today? And that's a good, that's a good lead in, right? And people say, yes, I am. And then I love when people say, wait, are you absolutely obsessed with the results you're getting? Are you married to it? Is it amazing? And I know that, there's a couple of people like Chrissy LeBlanc, I think leads this way. She'll lead you into the product conversation of collagen. Do you use it? Are you married to it? Do you love it? Are you obsessed? And they say, no. And she'll go, oh my gosh, I have a hold of an opportunity around with this product. You won't believe this collagen. So she's automatically defaulting into this opportunity. But I will tell you the reason, if you're new, the reason that I have found that the top-down approach works so well is that I can ask Lauren, I've got a hold of this opportunity. You got to take a look at it. It is, I'm partnered up with these products. They're market disruptive and they work like nothing people have ever seen. You'd be unbelievable. Okay, so Lauren goes, oh, too busy, too busy. Not interested in an opportunity right now, but hold on. Tell me more about these products that you're talking about that you're so excited about. Here's what used to happen to me. I'd go, Lauren, you got to take a look at these products. They're awesome. Oh my gosh, energy sleep. Whoa, I'm I'm flying. She's like, I'm not interested in any products right now. I'm just not a product person right now. I'm just not in that season of life. And I go, okay, Lauren, you're not interested in my products. Are you interested in a business opportunity around those products you just said you're not interested in? Guys, really, really tough to go up that ladder. Okay, come down, slide down the slide with ease. The sliding down the slide is, business opportunity. And I promise you this, it's going to feel uncomfortable in the beginning. You're like, oh my God, I'm not asking Lauren, a clinical nutritionist in Denver with a private practice. She says two master's degrees. I'm not asking her about the opportunity until you start doing it. And people like Lauren go, fill me in. Cause I've just been exploring options on Google about how I can earn an extra thousand a month. It's everywhere. The people are, it's wild. Who's looking for this. So Lauren, I talk so long, but let's do it. No, that's good. You guys not getting value out of this. I know the role play is really when we get to the compliment, but there has to be some context to understand where she's going from. And it helps because I've seen this and it's no joke. I mean, if I could figure out how to get to the top of mine and Jessica's instant message thread without just scrolling, if there was a way to like hit to the top, I could show you this. I mean, she would literally like send me screenshots of things she was messaging to people with like articles to isogenicshealth.net. And I would just be like, I have eight, like 18 clients today. I have no idea what you're asking me. Like, mm-hmm. I'm like, I don't have time to read this. And it was before all the voice memo stuff that we were doing, but it, there's no joke. So if you're thinking I can never sound like her, I can never do it. We're sharing that with you, not to make fun of Jessica, but because stay consistent, commit to getting better, you know, just try it and put yourself out there. And then also once she realized that top-down approach, the only other thing I wanted to say, and then I think we should do the comp plan and just like go through it because there was a few things that I'll highlight. And then this is where we'll probably cut it, you know, so that we have this little training call. Um, but with the, the top-down approach, outside of if the products are not interested, even if they're interested in the products, the other road bump that you hit there is they're like, oh yeah, I, I don't have a collagen, but my hairdresser said I should take it or whatever. And they get the collagen. And then all of a sudden you're like, oh man, I got to get to Tulum. I've got to create a consultant. And you're like, who wants to do this with you? Or I can show you how to get it for free. And yeah. people are really put off by that. They're like, what? I just wanted to try your product. Now it will happen naturally, right? Organically, there will be just like how Jess loved the jeans and you know, had everybody buy these jeans. There will be people that will say, hey, like my mom is curious about this. Can you help me get it for her too? Or hey, this girl at work saw me take it. And it will naturally happen. But we're talking about the accelerated path. We're talking about people that want to rank advance before NYKO, that want to come out of the gate make $5,000 in a month, you know, and not in six months. That's what we're talking about. And it doesn't mean when you post a story picture and someone says, hey, like Katie's transformation is amazing. What's she using? You know, that you're not going to send a link. You're not going to bring people in. 
But when you're building that dream team, when you're thinking about like, who do I want to see cross the, the stage? Who do I want to, who can I picture training at the next conference, you know, that I brought in? Like, who do I see having teams and teams of people with their own t-shirts and, you know, like all the things at the event, you're going after a different type of person. And honestly, this took me a very long time to understand that the difference here was I was comfortable leading with the business. I want to be really transparent with you guys, mostly because we want to be relatable. We know we're nine years in and it's a different skill set. I led with the opportunity very early on, tr transparently, probably before Jess did for two reasons. Number one, I desperately needed the money and I knew I had to get other people to share this. If like, you know, I couldn't just have product users, but the other is because I was a nutritionist and I was so burnt out of health coaching that I was like excited to talk about the money, right? Like that's what lit me up, but that's honestly what changed my life. You know, I was an executive two star, 40 pounds heavier than I am now. I mean, I had all the stories on why I couldn't talk about the product because I wasn't necessarily a product of the product at that point. I mean, truthfully, but I was like, you guys, I made more money this week than I did in the last three months. I don't know how, but I'm going to show you how to do it. Right. I mean, I was like that type of ignorance on fire leading with the business. But the difference with Jess and I, with her background, that I am so grateful that she's modeled and I'm mimicking it and it's working. You guys, when she's saying that she wishes she could show you that um, message or pull it up. You guys know we talk all day long. I mean, she literally screenshot it and was like, hey, look at this cross recruiting. And I was like, hot damn, you know? But exactly what she said is how it was. The girl talked about the credit card machine and she's like, you're freaking amazing. I love your energy. You should hop on a Zoom with me because you'd crush it at what I do. That was it. And then the next thing is the voice memo and you can tell they're scheduling. The thing is like three sentences long, but it's the posture and it's the conviction. So what I was going to say is I'm comfortable with the financial opportunity and my belief is very high, right? We're both seven figure income earners. We've been paid every Monday and now we get paid on Saturdays because the direct deposit, but I mean, it's never not happened. And you look at your life and the vision board and the things that are happening, but I was intimidated to reach out to certain people, right? Like if I'm looking at mine and Jessica's business, we were like this, like this, like this. And then there was this explosive growth and it's because she got in that discomfort zone, right? Of going after big players, and if you're the recruiter and you're putting your dream team together, you're not going to the Super Bowl with the amateurs. You're not. It's going to take a long time, right? You want to get people who are already trained. You want the best of the best. And then to be able to say, what we have here is the best. And that's what I loved about that call. Because I was fortunate enough to see the recording. And I just said, when you're talking to someone that's making, let's just, let's just throw out a number, okay? 300000 a year. Right. I mean, that would be what six star. What is that? Here, nice student. Six star, probably five, five to seven star, maybe. I don't know. Something like that. Four to six star, something like that. I don't have that. Let's just let's just say that. Right. So you're talking to someone who's making that consistently, not once, not recognition. And you go after that person and you say, all right, come on over. Let's make seven hundred fifty thousand a year. You know, when I think about how Janie's posture was with Jess, when Jess told her how much money she had to make and she said, let's go. And they did it, that posture and that conviction. And we've seen it done. We know a lot of people that have done it. And so when you hear her do this and the way that she can really cast the vision, this call might not be intended for everybody. And then we're putting that out there as a disclaimer, but if you really want to grow and you say, okay, how do I get to the next level? How do I bring in, you know, the next X, Y, Z, you know, like the conversation looks different. The vision casting looks different. You're not just going through the compensation plan. And it's going back to that list of the influences or who you want to attract and really recruiting. Because you can have 20 conversations with people that will get your business to a manager one star, right? And it's not to undermine those people. Very grateful for everybody and the people who want this to be side hustle. They want it to be, you know, a little passive income. But do you say, I'm looking for the next person who wants to go executive and max out this compensation plan. I'm looking for the next Susan Sly. I'm looking for the next Lynn Hagenor. I'm enrolling the next Emily Vavra. You've got to be very clear because that did not happen on accident. And then for them to say, okay, I'm going to look at you instead of my lash company. I'm going to look at you instead of the makeup company. I'm going to look at you and what was that? And the second thing outside of that verbiage, because I do, that's going to be the role play. Like we've got to figure out that I'm like a top earner, you know, with a skincare company or something. But when she does the compensation plan, and this is what I told Jess today, I, I teach the comp plan how Lynn Hagedorn taught it. She's the number one income earner. I watched all these videos and she always breaks it into three segments. She just did this in Orlando. If you were there, have you seen the recording? She says, here's how to get your products for free. And she does, you share, they share. And then she does the tracks to run on, which is the fast track to executive. And then she does the whole where the tree becomes the jungle and shows the residual income. 
And that's what I've been doing. And I was watching this reporting. And here's the other thing, you guys, if you ever thought like you don't need to learn anymore, like you can constantly be learning. But I was watching Jess do this and she went from getting her products paid for directly into those bonuses to the big picture. And I was like, oh my God, she never like wiped off the, the erase board. Like she's just going with this. But parts where I can see where people get lost when you show that you share, they share. And then you're talking about 10 consultants, you know, 10 people that have two, you know, friends that eat and have skin and blah, blah, blah. And they're like, wait, what's a consultant? And they haven't made the connection. The way that she did this was just so seamless. They yeah. said, we can't be passing around. Catalina, I see you asking about, this was a recording that she did with a prospect. So it's not posted anywhere um, that we can't have that. So we, let's mimic it. Like do it with me, pretend, you know, let's do the whole thing so that you can have this as a training tool. So that's, I think a little bit of background and I'd say let's dive into it unless you have anything else you want to yeah. say. Yeah. Well, I do want to say one thing is that someone messaged me privately and just said, well, if I'm not making any money, how do I leave with the business? Guys, here's what I want you to hear. You are on, if you're on one of our teams, you're on, you can say this, you are on one of the fastest growing businesses in this entire, one of the fastest growing organizations in the entire company. You're being led, you have that, the, your leader is a seven figure income earner in this company. We've both trained at some of the most premier events. I just trained at Most Powerful Women in Network Marketing with Eric Worre. I mean, that's a kind of a badge of honor. And I'm, I say that with humility, but I hope that you use it as validation. You can look across at these squares and look at proof, this deep bench of people that we have having incredible success. If you're just starting or you're not having the financial success that you want to, I say this to you in love. You don't have to be the crash test dummy to prove this out before you share it with other people because there are a ton of people you can point to. There are some incredible people who will support you and do a call for you. Seasoned networkers, seasoned people having success in this industry will help you. And honestly, you want to go, you want to create the compound effect. You need to start listening to people, making introductions. You need to start saying things like bananas because you heard Lauren saying it. You heard Ann White saying it. You heard Katie Martin saying it. You need to start getting other people involved in those conversations. Why? Third-party validation. I have Lauren. I'm doing a call for you tomorrow, Wednesday, Lauren, right? We do calls for each other all the time. Third-party validation. Lauren's a top. She doesn't need my help in any way. But why does it matter? Because third-party validation. So in any event, I want to show you guys. I think real you. quick before you go into that, the, the no money, both Jess and I were talking about how much money we were going to make and how much money people were making before we did it. Not disingenuously, don't lie. Don't tell someone you're making six figures. And if you're not, but when you say that I've partnered with a top earner in the company, I'm being mentored by and say, but here's what I tell you, I'm going to build an empire and you want to get a seat in my tree, you know, and then they can come in and they can see the people like both Jess and I said, get a seat in our business. There are people that joined when we first started that were like, I, that's the best thing I've ever done. They have thousands, tens, 20,000 to 40,000 BV going through their tree every single week. And they're like, I still don't know what you're doing, but I'm so glad you got me in when you did. You know, just it's the excitement and enthusiasm. Yes, absolutely agree. So let's, let me just talk about this. So just as an example, I'm going to give an example of kind of how I had, I did this and I, I did not share this recording with you, Lauren, but there's someone on this call. Her name is Jessica Holland. Jessica Holland was someone, let me just give you some context. A great friend. We have a mutual friend and Jessica Holland ran this Facebook page where she was, she had like an online boutique. And a friend of mine said, you got to check out this online boutique. I think you'll love it. So I look and I'm like, I do. I love it. This girl's awesome. I look at her personal page and I go, we would be friends in real life. We have a couple mutual friends. She's fabulous. What an awesome family person. And then she, I noticed that she's been in network marketing before. Like I can kind of see that she's been there and she posted that she was interested. She has this new company she's really excited about. And so I asked her, would you chat with me? I'd love to learn more about what you're up to and chat. And frankly, I hope Jessica, you agree with this. We had an awesome conversation where I like learned about her. I was so impressed with her. I was like, this girl's amazing. And she was telling me, hey, I'm going to join this company. It hasn't launched yet. And I was like, gosh, you would be awesome at what I do. And frankly, it was a conversation. And what I will tell you, and, and she teased me later and was like, I knew what you were doing. You, you're smarter than that. Like you knew you were going to try to recruit me. And in all fairness, my energy going into those conversations is like, how can I add, how can I learn most about that person? How can I learn from them? And what value can I add? So three things is my energy state. It's never about, can I recruit them guys? That's an ugly energy state. And she would have known that from the minute we got on the call, we wouldn't have been talking for like an hour. And so we get on the call and I'm like, tell her, I'm like, I, your company hasn't launched yet. If you're open to a bridge kind of opportunity, 
Um, she, she was open, you guys, I'm going to tell you the end of the story is Jessica Hahn sees this and goes to um, Crystal manager and she's about to lock in like I already told her husband, I told her to tell her husband, get his speedo ready because they're about to lock in Tulum, but this girl that was doing a bridge opportunity. And by the way, through Jessica Holland, I met this amazing girl named Jess Bruno. I met Jessica Rose, who's on this call. I met Elizabeth Tinsley. She's introduced, she's done the same thing. Can you introduce them? Can you, inter I mean, can you introduce them to me? I'd love to chat with them. She's, I'm not joking you that day I had the call with Jessica Holland. Jess, did I do five or eight Zoom calls for you that day? She goes, you gotta talk to my friend. You, can you do another call? Jump on right now. Then it got to the point where she goes, they're on. I'm like, okay, because I use the same Zoom. So she's like, people are on, get on there. Get, get on and do your thing, get your whiteboard. I'm like, uh, okay, I'm in the car, but hold on, let me get an envelope. I wrote the comp plan for someone on a dirty envelope with a pen that barely wrote. And I was like, can you see it? Can you see it? Hold on, I'll cut my hands around it so the shadow doesn't. Guys, I remember Brandy Brokaw saying to me when someone said, what do you do? She said, whatever it takes. So I got that dirty envelope and that crappy pen. And I was like, I will draw this comp plan. And the next time I take a car ride, you better believe I'm going to have a mini whiteboard and a marker that works. But that's the kind of conviction I'm in. You want me to show the comp plan in white? You want me to show it to somebody right now? I will. Two in the morning, set my alarm. I love it. If you're, if you want to learn this, if you're committed to knowing this guys, write it along with me, because that's called reticular activating system. You will learn it. I want to tell you guys, I made $119,000 in one month in isogenics. Okay. I don't say that to brag. I say that to tell you that when I do this comp plan for people, if you've seen me do it lately, I wipe this board down with an old piece of paper and my, I just got new dry erase markers. So if I can do this, if I can create that kind of income, you can do this. Sometimes I wipe it down with an old mask, an old disposable mask, sometimes with a dirty check. I'm never going to probably upgrade because I want you and other people to know if I can do it, you can do it too. So here's what I write with every person. The same thing, if you can see that good. A, underneath that C, underneath that M, underneath that D, underneath that E. So you're saying A, C, M, D, E, left-hand margin of your paper. And then I tell everyone, Remember that a lot of people I'm talking to are networkers. They understand compensation plans. So I say to them, listen, one of the greatest things in this company is the fact that every person has to come on as a customer. You can come on, you can call me and say, Jessica, I want to make great income in your company, or Jessica, I want to get rid of my crow's feet. You purchase the same thing, purchase the exact same thing, and you pay the same price. No weird conversations. But what you should know, and a lot of networkers know this, is it makes us completely defensible to regulatory agencies looking at this industry who have a big problem when there's multiple different structures for entry, people are buying these big dollar amounts and they're keeping you know, boxes of product in their garage. This makes us beautiful and defensible in the industry. And anyone who knows network marketing, it's been around for a while, knows that's a big deal. You also know that we don't have to go to someone and go, do you want to pay the lucky customer price, a magic distributor price, the double diamond secret super price where you have to pay big money to get involved in it? No, one price. A-C-M-D-E, you come on as a customer. And then I tell them, I go, listen, there are a bunch of starting of entry points in this company, but people start with bundles. Maybe you're someone who wants to start with 60 doses of type one marine collagen. Okay, well, you're going to pay $225 and free shipping. You're going to get wholesale pricing. You're going to have a money back guarantee. And by the way, every person who comes on, we give them a graphic to show them what they get when they have two friends try the product with them. Well, right now you're a customer and you say, hey, you know what? My mom and my sister want to try this with me. Excellent. Well, here's all you do. You're a customer right now, but I say, hey, I want to help you get your own link, your own referral cart link, just like I sent you a cart link. All you're going to do is you're going to convert your account to what's called associate. You click a button and you pay $29 for the year. That's the only fee to get your own referral link and the company can send you cash. Now you're an associate. You have a cart link. And so your mom, Susan, and your sister, Bridget, they say, hey, we're in. And they get the same thing you did. The company says, thank you so much. Here's your referral bonus of $25 for Susan and $25 for Bridget. 
because we go by the week. If you've been in network marketing and you're used to month end, I want to just tell you, I know you won't be disappointed. We don't have month end here. We go by the week and our weeks start on Monday and they end Sunday at midnight Eastern Standard Time. In that time period, so in Monday, you get Susan started and on Tuesday, Bridget orders her product. They double your bonuses after one person orders that week. And that happens every single week. People ask me all the time, well, what if it's three people? Great, they're all $50. What if it's 300 people, all $50? What if they order this and something else that has a bonus? They all double. It's all good. And then guess what? You have another opportunity in the following week. Well, here's what happens. So you earn $50 for Susan, $50 for Bridget. And guys, you hit the first goal which is called consultant. You can do this anytime, but consultant adds another $50. So you had another $50. So look, you and you shared with two people, they ordered and you earned $150. But of course we teach to everyone who comes on, we send them that graphic. Here's what you get for sharing with two people. Well, you've sent it to Susan. And Susan says, oh my gosh, my husband, Bob, and my neighbor, Gabriella, both want to try. Of course, so Susan converts to associate, gets her own order link, and she sends it to Bob and Gabriella. Well, look what happened to Susan, you guys. She became a consultant, hit that goal. She earned $150 in cash. By the way, the company also gives you $75 in product credit. So Susan became a consultant. Well, guess what? The company thanks you for helping someone get to consultant with another $100. Well, of course, Bridget, not to be outdone, does the exact same thing. She said, oh my gosh, my two neighbors are in. She gets the $150, $75 in free product credit, reaches the goal of consultant, and you get another $100. So let's go over here and on the math, let's add $100 for Susan, $100 for Bridget. But guess what else? You reach the next goal, which is called manager. Manager means that you have shared with two people who've shared with two people. You share, they share, or you plus two. You plus two, you share, they share. Now, the company has, whenever you see the word crystal in front of a rank, it means that you've done, you've accomplished a goal in a certain time period. Crystal manager, the company gives you 60 days to have two people share with two. If you do it in that time period, by the way, the clock doesn't begin until you convert to associate. It's not your order date, it's your conversion to associate date. They give you an extra $250. Guys, I show people this all day long. You just earned $600 and you've only shared right now with two people, Sue and Bridget. You've only shared with two people and you earned $600. By the way, for you guys, our core rank in this company, core rank means that if you become a manager producing factory, you'll see explosive growth in your company. It's the tipping point. Manager is our core rank. Go become a manager factory. Show people how to share with just two people who share with two, get 600 bucks and your business will explode. Get them to crystal manager. And then I tell them, hey, the next rank in our organization is called director. This is the next goal. Director means that you have six friends who share with two people. Director is six consultants. Crystal director, oh my gosh, this is too long, but they give you 120 days to do this. Success like speed in this case. Succeed, succeed, speed is so fun. It makes this go a lot easier, by the way. Crystal director, six consultants, 120 days. They give you an extra bonus of $750 to do that. By the way, every consultant that you help create, every person you order, every person who orders through you, who shares with two, you get another $100. At manager, you had two consultants. At director, you have six. So you added four consultants and you get $100 each. Guys, I will tell you, and I'm doing this as if you are not on my team. I'm gonna tell you, our team will clap for you. We're gonna give you a hearty, hearty golf clap for consultant, manager, and director. But I will tell you that the entire compensation plan opens up at executive. Executive, if my five-year-old was still awake, she would tell you the highest rank in my mommy's company is 10 people who know two people with skin or who eat. Guys, we make this so complicated, but if you understood what I understood, you would run to get to executive and stay there. Crystal executive means that in within six months, way too long, that's a cloak, 
You could do this in six days. If I told you that you would have your family generationally blessed, the next three generations of your family would be super naturally blessed with health, wealth, and opportunity, you would sit down at your desk and you would not get up. But we give ourselves six months and then we fall short and then we never go back to it. But Crystal Executive, guys, the whole compensation plan opens up here. 10 people who know two people with skin or who eat, the company gives you another $1,000 bonus plus $100 for the four new consultants that you've helped create. This, if you added this, this up, and this is upfront money, but this is, we used to teach a class called 5K in five weeks. This is 5,000, probably with now pool money. It's probably closer to 8,000. I've watched people do it in a week. But I will tell you that this is great. What I love about this company, and, and people that know I was a comp plan expert know that there are so many things about this compensation plan that are so unbelievably unmatched and positive. But one of the things is the executive. And so executive is the only rank where it must be five left and five right. And I love that about this company because it makes you build two strong teams and it forces you to have collaboration with people who are part of your team leg. What I want to say here also is that there's, a, there's an amazing opportunity to get people paid great money right up front. There's also an amazing opportunity to show them how to create recurring income quickly. Lots of it has to do with the compound effect. It means exactly what we were talking about when this call started duplication and depth will change your income. I used to be a sponsor monster. I mean, I enrolled a lot of people when I first started. I was excited about the product, just enrolled them. I made so much less than when I enrolled way, way fewer people. And I showed them how to do what I do. We became an Adrian McGovern, Denise Wiggins, Barb Kernan. You will remember these days. We were executive producing machines. We made Crystal Executive our standard. And then guess what? We would just tell people the highest rank in this company is 10 people. Can you believe that's all it is? 10 people helping them grab two friends that are up for trying money back guarantee. No risk. Guys, we used to make executive feel like it was like a complete, it was like, a, yeah, we're going to get executives. And you know what I had, the reason when people hear how much I earned in my first year, they go, how? Okay, well, I went to executive and so did six of my girlfriends in the first six months. Guess what they were doing? Adrian McGovern was saying to her best friend, Katie, Katie Gibson, and her sister, Bridget Roccobaldo, we go executive here. It's what we do. It became our standard. Guys, if everybody, if everyone on this team started to make an executive a standard for themselves and their team, you would see explosion. You want to see 100% growth? Watch out. Blindfold yourself because you won't even believe it. And so the other thing that I teach people, though, is I say, hey, listen, this is all the ranks, right? But I want to show you a couple of highlights. If you're in network marketing, I want to tell you some things that make your head spin around. I go, by the way, we only build two teams here. It's a binary plan. Anyone, and guys, this is from someone who was a comp plan expert. Anyone who says binary isn't best is either not in one or does not understand comp plans. What is better? Would you rather build eight teams wide by yourself or two teams where two thirds of your volume is built together with other people above you and below you, perfect strangers? Two thirds of our income is built together with other people. And I say to them, we are volume. This is unheard of in the industry. And anyone who's been in network marketing can confirm this. Our volume never flushes never flushes. As long as you're personally active, you retain all the volume from yourself, your team, their team, and people above you who are collaborating on that same team leg. Our volume never flushes. If you were in another company on the last day of the month, your volume on the first day of the month, your volume would be zero and you'd need to requalify for your rank in almost every company. In almost every company, you're paid on six generations if they're generous. And most of them are at a declining percentage. So imagine that if I enrolled Lauren, I get paid on her. Lauren enrolls Kathy, I get much less on Kathy. And as it goes down, I start to get almost nothing. Below my six level, I get zero. By the way, that means that people I wouldn't be working with would include someone as unbelievable as Ann White. I wouldn't get paid a dollar. I get paid 14 cents on Holly Kirsch and zero on Ann White. In mature organizations for experienced networkers, some of the greatest people come in deep in your downline. Jan Lauren was at least six levels down from Jenny Elo. People walk out of this industry because no one that knew what they were doing was 
they weren't in the pay line of anyone that had any knowledge of how to grow. So no one cared about them. Guys, in isogenics, you could come in on my 60,000th level and want to do this and be ready to rock and roll. And I'm going to roll up my sleeves and get down and dirty in the trenches with you. Why? Because I'm paid on your volume at 100% as if I personally enrolled you. Unheard of in this industry. It's called, there's, you say to people, there's no, anyone who knows comp plans will tell you in isogenics, there's no generational cutoff. There's no below my pay line. You're, you're in my organization. You're in my pay line. So you see two teams, no generational cutoff, and the volume never flushes. The collaboration of volume is something to see. Everyone has a team leg and a focus leg. And listen, here's the, here's the frank truth. If you're on a team leg where you see any volume below you, thank God for it. Because Lauren and I were both on a leg where no one, not even people that made a wrong turn, ended up underneath us by anyone above us. Literally, we built two legs all by ourselves. And I say that in love. I mean, in fairness, Denise Wiggins was added under me, but she, I gave her away to my neighbor because I said, you enroll her. So anyone that ever teases me about that, like Denise Wiggins ended up, thank the Lord, praise God, she got moved over to my side. But I didn't enroll Denise, but it, I would have. I told her about it. I sold her on it. But I said, go order from our neighbor who sold it to me. But guys, besides that, no volume came from anyone else. So if you have volume, be thankful for it. But I will tell you right now, you're looking at two people who build organizations without it. But if you have a team leg, let's say that I enroll you and then I enroll Lauren and then Lauren enrolls M and we're all on the same team leg. Well, M has someone, she calls and she's like, hey, I got someone awesome. Well, she builds two legs just like everyone else. Well, the team leg, she puts them here. She enrolls the next person that goes on her right leg is the same leg as me and Lauren. Same leg as all these other people who've come on. And so someone calls me and says, hey, somebody named M Sutherland just put a person on my downline. I think it's the, like a mistake. Nope, we build all together there. Well, Lauren goes, hey, I got somebody else too. Put them here. And then M's person sees them in her downline. This person comes up and I see her and Lauren sees her and you see her all the way up the chain because we share volume on this leg. It collaborates. And maybe on this leg, 60,000, you guys know we have something called BV. If you're new, it stands for business volume. It just means points. The reason that we do that instead of US dollars is we're global. So Lauren's talking to her team in Australia. She's not talking about US dollars. She's talking about a common metric of BV or points. Every product, no matter what it is, has BV associated with it. So on this leg, we're building and rocking and rolling. People are duplicating depth. They're selling higher value packs and they're converting. Everyone's a consultant. Everyone's a manager and executive is our standard. Oh my gosh, the volume's going bananas and we're all participating. On this side, this is my focus leg. Well, I'm going to build two strong teams. You better believe, I understand the comp plan opens up at executive. So you better believe I'm building an empire over here too. I'm putting Daniela Barrett. And then I'm saying, Daniela, grab two people. And she's like, oh, I got Brandy Brokaw and I got Desiree. All right, awesome. We're getting you to manage a girl. Get Brandy two people, help Desiree get two people. All right, we're going to executive. But Daniela, by the way, I'm going to enroll somebody else. I just met this girl, Colleen Cavini. She is the bomb. I'm putting her underneath you, girl, and watch out. By the way, Colleen, I want to introduce you. Colleen, I want you to meet Daniela. You two are powerhouses. You're both high fashion, hot babes. You have a lot in common. I'm dying for you to get together and just collaborate. And so you're going to share volume. So Danielle is like, cool, I got another girl to enroll. Okay, cool. She tells Colleen, hey, I just put somebody on our same leg. Great. Well, now the volume starts to accumulate and 300 BV comes up on this leg because these girls were building this powerhouse team. It's building. Well, the companies in a, in a recurring income, one cycle is what residual income equals and it equals $54. So what the computer sees is it says, oh my gosh, there's 300 BV that accumulate on this side. We are, we're gonna, we're gonna earn for you. We're gonna take that 300 away, okay? 300, we're gonna come over here and we're looking for 600 because one cycle is 600 on one side and 300 on the other. So it minus is 600. So it says, oh my gosh, now we have 59,400 left over. Keep all that. I took away the 300 and I gave you one cycle. That's $54. Oh my gosh. Well, Colleen's running to executive. Danielle's running to executive. We got Brandy Brokaw going. Another 300. Oh my gosh, you guys. The computer says, I got you on the 300. Let me come over here. Deduct the 600. Now we got 58, 58 and 800. Oh my gosh, you got all this volume. Still leaving it alone. Now another cycle, two cycles. 
guys, it's accumulating. The more the compound effect is kicking in, the faster 300 is coming over here. I'm selling value packs. There's 100, 320 BV. That was our favorite pack. A value pack was a standard. Value pack nutrition. I know Holly Kirsch, I know that's her standard still. If somebody's coming on with nutrition with Holly, they're getting on a value pack. I mean, she told me the other day, she just asked them, do you have a multivitamin that you're obsessed with that you think has an anti-aging component? If not, you need to look at this one. And she gets people on the value pack for nutrition, 320 BV. Imagine what's happening. And so you're seeing this residual income occurring, but I'll tell you, get people to executive and that's the bomb diggity. That's where it all just compounds. Laura, what, what else on the comp plan? Is there, people have questions about how this works. Five and five. Five have to be on your left side. Five have to be on your right side. And why? I watch some people, gosh, oh, I want to cry. I look at people's businesses and I see that they enroll one person over here. Team leg. Left side or the right side. One person. Nine people down this other side. Okay, now you're a consultant, my friend. But as soon as your left person stops ordering, you fall out of consultant. You don't earn. So you're chasing cycles. But what I want to teach people is you're going to take from the team leg. You better give back to the team leg because executive, you're just chasing $54 and you're giving up $70,000 to chase 54. And you're putting yourself at such risk of not being paid at all. So here's why executive. I'm going to end with this. And any questions, drop them in the chat though so I can see them. But executive benefit. Why, do I, why am I obsessed with executive? One, when you're an executive, you are in a 10% match of every person you personally enroll cycles. Why am I fanatical about people that want to go the distance enrolling their spouse, parent, someone they love as one of the first people? Personally enrolling. Guys, my husband is a six star in the company. That's 150 cycles a week. I earn a 10% match on his business. Let's just say for the sake of math, he's 100 cycles a week. That's $5,400 that Doug is earning. I make $540 a week just because of Doug's match. Never give away people who could be, who have the skill set to do this. If they say they're never going to do it, don't believe them. I would have said that same thing. If they have a skill set, never give them away. Please, goodness gracious. Get to executives. You can earn a 10% match and get insanely obsessed with your team creating income because that 10% match can equal $13,500 a week for you. For you. Can you imagine if you enrolled Lauren Frierson, you get a 10% match on her success? What? So that's the number one reason to be an executive. Please be an executive. Let's have a moment of silence for the woman who enrolled me. She's not an executive. That's a lot of dough to be leaving on the table. If you were an executive, just my match alone would be good money for her. So number two, ELB, the executive lifestyle bonus. You get 700, just, it's, it would be like if I worked at Citibank still and just for showing up and doing my job, the CEO would walk out and goes, Jessica, do you, you did your job this month? $750 extra for you here, cash. Next month, another $750. The next month, you've been consecutive, $1,000. And they do that every quarter, 750, 750, 1,000. Repeat, repeat, repeat all year. That's $10,000 in bonus money just to be an executive. That's You have to be an active executive the entire month and enroll two people over that course of that month. That's all you have to do to earn $750. Imagine giving yourself a $10,000 raise, ELB. Executive bonus pools. These are leadership pools every month. They're based on leader in action right now. Spoiler alert, you're going to be seeing even bigger money. I'm going to tell you right now, Lauren, I told you it's a secret. It's not a secret because I'm dropping on this call. Get yourself to executive friends because the pool money is about to go through the roof, the roof. And we're not going to do leader in action anymore. We're going to do growth. And that's what I'm, That's this is all spoiler alerts. But anyway, executive leadership pools. Right now, you can earn up to an extra $5,000 a month. Not the cycles. Not the upfront money. This is extra on top of that. Five thousand a month. That's five thousand times twelve. That's sixty thousand dollars. So just right here, guys, I'm just talking about seventy thousand dollar raise. ELB ten thousand dollars a year. Five thousand dollars a month in the pools is sixty thousand dollars. That's seventy thousand dollars on top of cycles, PIBs, matches, etc. 
Four, I love free trips. I like them when they're really glamorous, very, very high end. Well, to go on trips, you need to be an executive to go to Global Top Achievers, to go to a lot of the bigger trips, not, not Tulum, but the Global Top Achievers, the high, high end places you can't even believe you're going. You got to be an executive. Half, right now, 26 weeks out of 52, you have to be an executive. So trips, leader in action, all the things are driven by that. When you're an executive, you get the most points. So many reasons to be an executive. And if you've ever thought to yourself, I could never do that. I want to just tell you that Lauren used to tell me there were more people in, a, in spin classes that she taught than there were to get to executive. 10 friends who just say, Susan, I'm going to try this with you. Money back guarantee. I'm going to try it. And I want to get, and I know it works better when it's just about free. So I have two friends that will do this with me. Money back guarantee. Yeah. I get, I get a link. Oh, easy done. And that's what I would tell you guys is this is a new mindset. This is a mindset in an industry that is right now radio silent to a world that is begging, longing, dying for an opportunity to create more income without spending more time outside their house and a world that's focused on supplementation. The last thing and I said, I'm going to end with the executive, but let me just also say this. I, I've been talking to Lauren a lot about this is that when we first started, frankly, if I'm being totally honest with you, it was weight loss. I came in for weight loss. I talked about weight loss. Then I started talking more about collagen. Well, now I'm, I believe that the world's conversation has radically shifted where there's a lot of talk about triggering people or body shaming, but now there's this focus on health on on preemptive wellness, on cutting edge science. How do we biohack our body? So we're talking about this biohack stack. Do you guys understand the revolutionary ahead of their time products that we have in NAD, nootropic, adaptogen elixir, this collagen off the chains? We are now having new conversations with people about preemptive wellness. How do you hack your body to create optimal health? to create clarity that you've never had, to create natural sleep, wakefulness patterns, to literally reset your cells. You know, if you're not taking NAD right now, I implore you get on it and see what happens. You will be a changed person. You gotta take it for a prolonged period of time. You gotta trust me on this. NAD is genius, brilliant. If you have a restore wellness in your town, go and look at what an NAD infusion would cost and why so many people are lined up. You can barely get one because people understand the value of them. NAD is brilliant. This product is genius. So the conversation, I'm shifting it, quite frankly. Collagen's awesome. But guys, I'm talking a more inclusive conversation about our whole blend shakes, our plant-based nutrition, I'm talking about adaptogens. I'm talking about things that the world is now starting to talk about, but we're just a little bit ahead. We've been talking about intermittent fasting for nine years. And when Lauren and I started, the people that I was talking to go, yeah, that's called starvation. Now the whole world is talking about intermittent fasting. We're a little bit ahead of the curve and the people that understand it want to be part of that conversation. We need to be having that conversation loudly with confidence and posture. You're in the right place at the right time. And there's no compensation plan like this one. Nice job. Okay, we will figure out where to um, cut this and edit it so that you get all of those goodies and um, understand the comp plan. You guys, this is not necessarily the comp plan you want to send your prospects. Maybe it's more for a tool for your builders to learn how to teach it, but watch it over. Like have this just playing. You guys like playing it over and over and over. Like do it when you can write down the notes, play it in your shower, play it in your car, play it when you're cooking dinner so that those things start to roll off your tongue more naturally. And it's intertwined. And when you can hear the master, just not only vision cast as she's teaching, but that fluidity of like, there wasn't this break off of you share, they share, right? She was like, here's the ranks. But it was like, she talks about what happened. You shared with two friends, you know, using that verbiage, you get a few friends to try it. It's hundred percent money back guarantee. It's all coming together in vision casting. She didn't talk about the pool money, you know, I mean, just saying that and talking about real people. When you see Danielle come in here and you're seeing Colleen and all these people are coming in you, do that when you're talking to people because it makes it real. It's not this tangible, you know, out there concept. It's very real. And then that begins to happen and you speak that fruition into your team. So Jess, thank you for doing this. You guys are amazing. I know we're a little bit over, but this is such a good call. And I just want to give you guys all a lot of love and a swift kick and up to go crush Tulum. You guys can all 
do this. And I will tell you this, as the leadership pools are the way that they are now, November and December are the months that you want to play in them. Like I literally strategize my business all the time and was talking to Jess and that's intentionally, intentionally why I'm building Ryan's business right now, because I know what the share values are in November and I know what they are in December. And so get your butt into the pools, get yourself to that trip. It will be absolutely amazing. And it all works together. So you guys are phenomenal. We're so grateful. Please reach out with any questions. And when Jess says she's all in and she will do this, literally, we, we I'm not kidding. We will do the comp plan over and over. If you ask us to clench coach a lot of people right now, we're both rolling our eyes. We're not lying. We'll help you, but headaches and diarrhea doesn't excite us. Okay. But any time in the morning, any country, any language, any gender, any company, like we are getting on we will do this over and over and over. And so if you're excited and you say, hey, I want to reach out to this person. She's in the top runner with the company. Can I tell them I'm partnered with you? Yes, we will get on. We will do it. We're so excited and really, really thrilled about where Isagenix is going. So thank you guys so much. Love you. Thanks, Jess. Thanks. Bye, Lauren. Bye, guys. Thanks so much.